I guess it's the widest space to do. Okay, so here's uh, some more shenanigans with John and Paul. Uh, we are, before he trips himself. This is the fence line that our neighbor said we could go ahead and take down here and then bring the bus directly through. A uh, little hunting camp and stuff. So I'm gonna give it a shot. We can take this down and then uh, we'll go from there. <laughs> Better take some limbs down, but for right now we're gonna go. We're gonna go check this out. Okay, we are going to walk on down here. The silver camper that we have at the house actually came from back over here. He uh, he ended up uh, giving that to us. They have family and stuff that comes out. They stay in these campers here, and then they got that camp, that uh, house right there that they converted into. There was a I think a trailer that they converted into and added an addition to it. So let's see here. This is where Silver Camper was sitting. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Pretty cool, huh? Well, if I can get the window open, we can release that arm. MacGyver. <laughs> Real life. In action. This is John trying to push the handle to open the door. There it is. And he got it. All right. Let's check it out. MacGyver strikes again. <laughs> MacGyver strikes again. <laughs> Okay. Remember, you're steering the bus, Dad. <laughs> it's seen better days. It I has. Think. Does all this stuff inside go with it for the price? Pretty much. Wow, that's a heck of a deal here, John. We get to have a little uh, bonfire. <laughs> Do you take it out before you burn it? Uh, you know, that's an idea. You got a wood burner here, just put it all in there. <laughs> well, the floors feel decent. Oh, check out the mud daubers. And is that a real live restaurant? There's a toilet back here. What? A toilet. A toilet? Crazy. Well, the floor's solid. Yeah. Why don't you try starting it? <laughs> I would start it if I knew where the key went. MacGyver can hotwire a bus. Come on. <laughs> of course, the battery's sitting outside over there, so that's. Yeah. Weird. That might not do too well. I think we probably had a few <laughs> animals in here. Alright. And now what? Yeah. Well, I got it off the tree. <laughs> okay. So where do we tow this guy from, or push it?
What? Hey, the door still works. That's pretty amazing. All right, ah, what do we got here? They put a waste tank in here one time. So, you gotta air up the tires. Try to, we could push it, but that could damage the bumper. Huh? <laughs> John, come on right here. It looks to me like they had a tow strap or something, but right down here, yep. around this thing, and come out the bottom. Yep. Well, we can pull. Yeah, we can pull. Oh. <laughs> There's something in there. You can get you a radiator. <laughs> so, was this a school bus or a city bus? Maybe a school bus. It looks like the place for the red lights there. Could be. The fight says, God bless America. Yeah, here's your fine. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, yeah, the wheels are turning. No steering lock. Yeah, they're turning good. Okay. You got it far enough we can go right now. All right. Hey guys, so uh, the very first thing we got to do here is got to figure out if the the, uh, the tires on the side will actually hold air. Uh, I'm on I'm making a recording, guys. Can you wait? So um, the back tire over here is low in air. Uh, this one here looks pretty low. The other sides are actually holding air. So if I can get the front uh, to hold air, then I think we'll have a good good chance of getting this thing out of here. Um, I'm going to be, take my tripod over with me and I'll get to show you. A generator here, chainsaw, and air compressor. And if all works out well, we're going to see about maybe uh, pushing this back to that direction. Uh, turn the wheels uh, to the left and then kind of back it in this way, back it out that way. And then what I'll have to do, this looks like the straightest path out of here, so I'm gonna have to clear this area to get it out because I'm not getting past these two trees here. I don't wanna, that's a pretty nice tree. I'm not gonna take our neighbor's tree down. So, and that one too. So anyway, that's, that's the path right there, which will have to be taken. So let's go ahead and put this on time lapse. And uh, let's see how it goes. Okay, these are supposed to be filled to 85 pounds at full capacity. They should give us, uh, we're up to about 70 here. That should give us enough capacity to roll this thing. Down there, those are looking good. Got these for about 50 each. This will be good. So what I need to do now is uh, clear out, I need to clear out some of these trees here, small trees, uh, scrub brushes and stink, things like that so that uh, back this thing up a little bit. This one right here above Mr. Gus Gus. Hi Gus Gus. And then uh, probably bring the tractor over here. There were some metal metal pieces here. Where'd they go? There they are. Uh, right over there. So probably want to move. Just get the uh, tractor over here and clear out all of this stuff so that we can see where we're going. And so I'm going to do a little bit of this right now.
Okay, looks like we've got some good amount of trees down here. This should give, give us a good path. I got, just gonna clear all this debris and stuff out of the way. And just push all the stuff down that way. Looks like Gus ran off with my hats, both of my hats. They were right there, and they're gone. So, damn dog. Alright, time to go.